everybody. We are back again. Uh, this week, we actually, we needed a swatch. Uh, and I think that, you know, it came out really nice. So I think we're gonna call it a pot holder or maybe a kitchen towel. I would, maybe... make, I would make more and make a blanket. Oh, okay, so a kitchen but towel. But people like to have kitchen towels. Yeah, kitchen towel slash we blanket. Don't do we don't do kitchen towels, no. do we? No. But anyway, it's it's a cute little <laughs> it's a cute little swatch, and it's got all these little um, holes, and it's got this nice little pattern going on, uh, but in just one color. And uh, we even made up a chart, didn't yes, we? We made a chart. And Arne has brought out his humongous needles again, <laughs> and we thought that today, yes, they are the big ones. My. Pedagogy. No, that's not pedagogiske pinni. Yeah, well. In English, what's that? I don't know, it's something know. Yeah. weird. weird. So, uh, anyway, this week we thought we'd show you what the different symbols mean on the chart mm -hmm. and how you can achieve them when you knit this kind of technique. Yeah. So this time we will give you the number of stitches that you cast on. Mm -hmm. Actually, you, you can count it, but we will be kind and we will give you the number. And then you should knit from this just by reading the symbols mm -hmm. so we will show you how to make knit the symbols okay so today it's all about knitting the symbols yeah and we won't do the knit and the pearl because we showed that already yes but the the blue squares in the pattern it's that's the knit and the white that's the pearl. Okay. And when you do the pattern, you work on the knit side. That's the where the pattern is made, and then you purl back every second round. Mm. So what you need to know is what is this symbols? So I can show you. We start with the circle, this one. The circle means you make a stitch. And when you make a stitch, you just put your yarn, the, the, your needle under the yarn, and then you knit the next one. You see, then you made a stitch. Mm -hmm. I can show you one more. Just under, place the yarn on the needle, and then you continue knitting. And this, you made another stitch. This way you make a stitch. Mm. That's the circle. Okay. And then we've got triangles, right? Yes. And then you know every time you take, you take away a stitch, you have to make a stitch. Because you want to keep the square piece. Square. So this shape mm. is square. Yeah. So you every, want to keep it square. Yeah, so every time you make one, you have to take one away. Or if you take one away, you have to make one. Mm. Because you have to have the same number of stitches. Okay. And then we will show you the the triangle that is pointing towards left. The left, yes. That means you slip one, you knit one, and you lift the stitch. You slipped over the one you knitted. Okay, so let's do that. <laughs> I'll show you. So you just slip one, you knit the next one, you lift the one you slipped over. That's the triangle that is pointing to the left. Mm -hmm. One more time. Slip, knit, and lift. And lift. Perfect. And when you do this, the stitch that you slipped will point towards the left. the left. Let's do another symbol. Okay. Then if you look at the triangle that is pointing to the right, this one, that means knit two together. Mm -hmm. The normal way. So just take... And I'll show you. I knit one first, then you just go in front of these two stitches and you knit those two stitches together like that. And now you see the last stitch will be on top and it will point towards me. Carlos. So the right. The right. Mm. That's very nice when you do 
things like this. When you see the pattern, the stitches are pointing towards the center of this leaf. And that's what you get when you do those two different decreases. The triangle pointing to the left and the triangle pointing to the right. Two different ways of increasing, decreasing. And then you have the last symbol, that's this half circle kind of, called half circle, the bow. The yeah, let's call it, well, let me see. Why don't you call it a pyramid? Or no, it's a half circle. It's half a half circle. circle. We call it half circle. This is something we made up. So, okay. How this half circle? I show you what a half circle is. Half circle is decreasing in three stitches. Decrease, decrease three and get one. Hmm. And the way you do it is you slip the first stitch, then you knit the two next together and then you lift the one you slipped over. Then it looks like this. Hmm. And when you did this, you lost two stitches. So if you do this, you should make one, slip, knit two together, and lift over, and make another one. So you see, every time you decrease, you have to make a new one somewhere in the pattern. And like now I made one, knit those three together and I made one. So we're back to the same number. Mm. That's all you need to make this. Which will be this. Yeah. And again, you read from right and this way. And you work, you work your way this way and up. Mm. And every second round in the pattern is a pearl. Yep. Except in the corner, in the edge, because you you want to have a nice edging, like the the pearl knitting, like this. Okay. Okay. So we're done. That's what you need to know. That's you can all knit you need from to know. this drawing. You don't need to have like a whole book of written instructions. Yeah, so we're posting the chart on our website arnacardos.com. You can go there, download it, and you can start knitting your little uh, kitchen towel slash wipe, per possibly a blanket if you yeah. knit loads of these and sew them we together. We can make more pattern and put them together. Maybe this is the beginning of a blanket. Oh, another UFO. Another UFO. You never know. You never know. <laughs> so anyway, uh, if you enjoy uh, watching our channel, please don't forget to subscribe. And uh, remember, every week we are back with a new tutorial. And uh, most of the time there is a pattern online that you can just download after the tutorial at arnicarlos.com. So uh, until next time, thank you for watching. Bye. And happy knitting. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye.